So today hasn't been one that's been my absolute favorite. In fact, it's it hasn't been exactly the worst one I've ever had, but it's kind of up there. Today we found out that the stray cats decided to claw through the ductwork, and that means we don't have any air or heat, and it is really warm in here right now. After this, I'm going to be turning off, the, I'm going to be turning, well, no, it's actually on. I'm going to be opening the window and letting some air in. Either that or I'm going to go sleep outside in the dirt because it'd be a lot cooler. But other than that, my computer decided to bite the dust again, which means for my other channel, I'm not going to be able to do gaming, I'm not going to be able to do fun challenges because I'm not going to have a way to record it, and that sucks. I just, uh, today has just been not one of the greatest days at all. And it's going to cost me $70 to get a new hard drive for my computer. So, t Monday, I'm going to go out and I'm going to find a job. And I'm hoping that I can find one that's understanding because my health issues keep me down a lot. And if I can't, then it's going to be a real big battle and it's not something I want. But right now, I'm taking time to really sit by my Christmas lights that I have up and just think through all of my stories and things that I want to write down and just places that I would rather be, characters that I would rather be. I have so many stories that have not gone all the way through and I have one that I've been working on since 2007. It is yet to be published in any form or fashion, but I still have a deep connection to it and I even have a tattoo for it. And it's got me really interested again because I've just watched rewatched The Crow, my favorite movie, and I really want to sit down and I want to try to write a new chapter. I just have to find a piece of music to go with it because music has really always helped me to get into the scenario and in the situation and write from the perspective of the character and bring so many wonderful things into it. So that's going to be my task over the weekend, the rest of the weekend, because it's already Sunday now. I have so many hopes and dreams for the future that I want to see come true. I've always had this dream of having a house out in the country with a wraparound porch and I can leave the door open, the back door open during lunchtime to catch the cool breeze and I can play music and just either sing and dance around the kitchen while I make lunch or just enjoy the atmosphere and that's always been a big dream of mine. I still sometimes not regret, I still sometimes regret not going to Salem when I had the chance just to have a new start, just to get away and have that experience, but then again I wouldn't be here and I wouldn't be doing this. So in a way the competing emotions, it just, you don't know exactly what you want to do or what you should have done. All you think is the chances that you would have had or would it be better, would it be worse, how would things would have gone. And I'm still trying to figure that out, especially for myself, but I'm taking time tonight just to relax, watch Netflix, read some books, or just sit here and, and just dream. Dreams, for me, have always been an escape from absolutely everything, and that's exactly what I want this to be. I want this to be an escape for people that need it. I want it to be a place of hope and a place of beauty and imagination. You know, being a dreamer is not a bad thing. It's a wonderful thing. It can help you through so many times in your life, so many difficult times, or to help you process the wonderful times. And I just hope that this channel helps somebody with that, helps inspire and, and bring them back into the good things in life. Because even though so many things have gone wrong right now, I have so many hopes for the future and I don't want to give up on them. I'm gonna keep trying, I'm gonna keep doing this. One way or another, I have to, I want to, this is what I want to do. So one way or another, I'm gonna make it happen. But I'm gonna go dream, I'm gonna listen to music, and I'm just gonna lose myself in all of it. But I love you guys and thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.